不要惊慌，所有人员有我撤离，等待撤离。Why didn't you guys warn me about that? Did you see that thing? I was about to walk right into it. You kidding me with this? What is this thing? Yeah, all right, everybody. Welcome to the indie showcase with the Birdman. I am said Birdman. This here is the killing antidote, and it's one that kind of just cropped up on me. As a matter of fact, this one was、uh, pointed out to me by a couple of people on my Discord. They were like, "Falcon, have you checked out Killing Antidote yet?" I had not. I looked into it and I was like, you know what? I、uh, I should have. I absolutely should have. This is gonna be one of those games that caters to you third-person shooter survival horror fans. Think of the modern-day remakes of the Resident Evil games. I feel this game is gonna fit right into that little niche. And the upside of this game here is that, in case you happen to play those games with certain mods, we'll say, here in particular, you don't you don't need to. Go out of your way to do that. Based. All right, and just like that, we're in here. Now, this is only a demo, mind you, so who knows where in the story this is? But this is what we're starting off. In case you're wondering,、uh, your character completely customizable, as I've mentioned from the start. Twenty thirteen, February eighth, at eleven fifteen p.m. 这里是隶属于 X 基因科技的第七生化研究所。根据物流记录显示，这里是引发 Z 型传染病的药剂样品发货地。现在，这里是一片狼藉，人员应该已经全部撤离了。但愿，我能找到一些线索。什么声音 ？Oh, I think we all know what that is. Now this is gonna be like another offshoot umbrella type of deal. You know what? Normally these games tend to be that for sure, obviously. But then again, even Resident Evil series got it from like you know just popular zombie horror media. So did they all follow you know evil corporation playing god and something went awry? Yeah, absolutely, I would say. What do we got here? Hard disk drive. Looks like it's broken, but there could be some important data in it. Is that right? We got a med kit as well. Very interesting choice of、uh, outfit she has here for apparently some sort of detective work. I would say, you know, I'm not sure. It feels a little bit too free and easy, but hey, that's just me. Not like I had any control over it. You know what I'm saying? All personnel will quickly gather at the fifth floor activity center and wait for the rescue convoy. No delays will be allowed. Consequences will be incurred. Consequences will never be the same. So whatever you do, um, if these these infected individuals come out, don't don't hit them in the head. All right. Because um, then we'll be liable because they will not be able to be returned back to normal, and then uh, we'll have a lot to answer for then. I like that, but at the same time, it's giving you a clue. Go for the head. I mean, obviously, if you played any zombie game, you already know that. But I like it in terms of the the general lore of the world. You know, here we're pretending that zombies aren't an, an existing thing. You know, so for them, it's like zombies. No, never heard of. 全体人员请注意。未知病毒传染性较强，为减少扩散，请做好防护，不要惊慌。所有人员有序前往撤离地方，等待撤离。Any、uh, Chinese bros wanna go ahead and、uh, tell me what that? I think over Tom was speaking. We didn't get any subtitles for that one, I don't think. Now the zombies do seem like they're gonna be. I've seen these zombies in other games before, so we're dealing with definitely、um, zombie asset store. But you know, it's fine. I would say it cut me off. I said it's fine. I don't mind acid, you know, packs from other from stores being used in games. You know, if you use them properly, right? So there's at least some sort of effort put into. I don't really mind if, like, you know, it's using acids from another, well, from a store they could just buy acids from. You know, everyone gets their start some way or another. So yeah, have I seen these zombies elsewhere? Absolutely. But again, it comes down to how they end up utilizing the game. And so far, you know, hey, I'm seeing some effort being put in. Let's 
Just gonna, just gonna walk over here now. Oh my god, they're all coming alive. Uh, oh, they guess they are. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, dog. Hey, dog, you need to chill. Hey, dog, you need to chill. The head falcon. Look, dog, I know about the head. I, I need to, like, get the dog first. Oh, I see. Yes. All right. As I said, a little bit of effort. And I'm okay with it. The hell? Oh. Well, obviously my um, impromptu go, go to cr control for crouch does not work. But it does give you a little quick evade. All right. I like that. Here we gotta use the old conventional C. Okay. Nothing much there. Really? Good idea. Bad idea. You absolutely could, but the problem with that idea, Falcon, is what? Yes, that if I miss, uh, you got no weapon? Yes, that is indeed the problem with that. Can you, you do it again? Huh? Can you do it again, though? <laughs> you better believe I'll do it again. Hey, right, look. It's the way of life, you know? You, just because something fails the first time doesn't mean you got to give up for good. You got to come back to it, you know? You got to get yourself back up, dust yourself back off, and give it another shot. What do we got here? Input password. Have we picked up any documents with passwords? I mean, it wouldn't be right. Oh my god, it actually is. <laughs> Why would the password be that? I'd imagine that was just maybe the, it's kind of a weird room number, sure, but whatever. Oh, here we go. All right. But you guys were dead. I had killed you. All right, Daddy. You wanna play this game? Huh? You wanna play this game? Chang Chang the Li Hai. I will cap that ass if I got to. Right. Let's let's save the animal. <laughs> I thought I heard somebody running about. <gasps> Who was closing that door behind me? Yo, let that bullet go through? Or did he just stumble into this boy? I guess he just stumbled into him. Ah! Alright. Oh, another knife. Is that another knife? Another hard drive. Apparently there's 20 different clues in his level, huh? How about that? So we got options. Number one, we got to go through here first, obviously. But after this, we I think there's two doors that we've seen that require. Ooh. All right. What lies behind door number one? Oh, I see. We could save on the bed <laughs> as opposed to uh, the old typewriters, huh? Got a backpack. Bill's here. And some shoes. So it seems, um, yeah, you're going to be able to get different outfits to also uh, dress up your character. I'm a big fan of that, too. <gasps> Why didn't you guys warn me about that? Did you see that thing? I was about to walk right into it. Kidding me with this? What is this thing? Oh, he ain't dead. I'm popping the second one in his dome piece. He dropped bullets for me. Yeah, he wasn't dead.
Uh, oh my god. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um, just let them file it. Oh, that was on me. Think they're all dead, Falcon? Nah, I am buying. I am buying. What other bodies has appeared? Um, in the options menu, there's like a... Uh, you could set how many bodies could stay on the screen at once. I guess to basically um, help you with performance issues, because, you know, otherwise, like, there's a lot of these, like, highly detailed models on the screen, so it drives, you know, I think, like, Resident Evil games and modern ones do that as well. Um, the default was three. I didn't really bother to change it. I'm pretty sure I could probably hide in a bit more. But yeah, I think one of them disappeared because of that. Okay. Right now, we're A-OK. -okay. Um, let's see. I have two heals. You know what? Let me at least drop the pills here. Pills here. I gave me ha oh, my half of my HP back. That's good. That's good. Oh, there's another one over there. Is that you guys walking about? I hear like footsteps and it's like, I guess the ones behind me. I decided it was like coming from like the hallway. I was like, yo, dude, is somebody back there still? Hello, my friend. Yeah. So they could disappear. You know what? At the very least, you know, I think it's almost even like a cheap way for you to be able to tell if zombies are dead if you just lower it down to like say like one body on the screen or something. Because <laughs> if it disappears, you know for a fact it's dead. I I'm just saying. Sneak up on this door and just, just go peace out. <laughs> yes, sir. So you can even um do a little bit of stealth if you want to. So how about that? Well, let's indeed, uh... I'm not sure if somebody's crying or like... Oh my... Don't do that! That's actually very creepy that you have that capability on you, you, you freaking zombie. Would he drop behind me, you wonder? You wouldn't, right? He couldn't. That's fine. That's acceptable. Finish him up before it gets up. I'm, I'm trying. Man. I'm trying. Okay. Let's go. Okay. We good? Everything good right now. Perfect. Now, can we explore these weird sounds we heard? Not through there. I guess it was kind of coming through here, but this door is red, so... Okay, here we go. So whereas the zombie could just jump over there, not us. We gotta take the long way. Unequipped a weapon in your hand. Oh, really? Thank you. Thank you for that information. I'm kind of worried I'm gonna jump over there without any, any sort of weapon in my hand and um, I'm gonna suddenly be grabbed, you know? I mean, I, I gotta be honest with you, I'm a little bit shocked. I wasn't expecting a little bit of platforming in this game, but there is. You know what, unless I know what I'm dealing with, I'm going to go handgun first, all right? <laughs> Call me paranoid, but that's fine. I'd rather be paranoid than not. Than <sighs> <laughs> you scumbag. Oh, you got me pretty good. You got me pretty good. Okay, this is what we saw earlier that required the, uh, the chopping down that I mentioned. They, uh, they hit me with the door, dog. <laughs> they hit me with the door. How, how dare they do this? You guys are dead, right? Lord, we'll be young. 
，兄弟，帮我个忙吧，把我给毙了。Where'd you come from? Shooting the lock on the wooden door can destroy the lock. Really? Oh, 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 oh boy! Oh, that's not creepy at all. Excuse me. Where do you keep filing in from? It was the dude from the wall. He tracked me down. Cause I, I'm not sure if he tracked me down literally or is because he heard the noise when I popped this guy. Although we were shooting over here and he didn't pop then. But then again, he probably only activated once we put him in our line of sight. I'm confused about that entire... I mean, I'm confused about where these guys keep coming from. But this guy, I know exactly where he's from. Holy hell. That, uh... <laughs> that really got me, dog. Okay. Um... My dude? They're just... Okay, they're just spawning infinitely now. See, now that I don't like. You had a pretty good thing happening here, Kayla. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of these, uh, you know, let's just spawn zombies just to spawn zombies to you. Like, once I put in the work to keep myself safe, that should be it. I gotta shoot only? Okay. I just wanted to see if there was an alternate option, but... Seems we might have some more, uh, items for ourselves. I know. They just keep filing up at this point. It's very annoying. The waste of ammo. It'd be fun if they at least dropped ammo. If they're gonna keep infinitely spawning them. But they ain't. So far, you know what? That's my only complaint so far. These are apparently infinite spawning zombies here, at least. Otherwise... I've been relatively impressed by this so far. I feel like there's a zombie behind there waiting to grab me. Uh, and Ron just said, yep, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? Huh? You gotta, you gotta wake up pretty early in the morning, my friend. I'm gonna do this, you're saying? Well, I mean, I could, um, I could do this, perhaps. You just get his, his dome piece to pop up right here. Huh? You pop a little dome piece? A little dome piece like that, huh? huh? Think you're cute? Think you're slick? Thinking it's slick. Ah. Oh. Some new... shoes there as well. Why do you guys sound like you're literally right next to me? Oh, they're password. <gasps> That's what you sound like you're next to me. Sounds Sounds like you're next to me because you guys keep spawning randomly from there for no reason at all. Well, oh. <laughs> Gotta play it a little smart, you know? See you over there, homeboy. You know what I like about this, too? The fact you can recover these weapons again. It's so good. It's not like one of those games where apparently, you know, your knife has like three usages before, you know, it's it's gone for whatever reason. Like, oh, you could only use this knife three times, and then afterwards you just grow it completely. It's like, come on, Doug, for real. I can't 
let's go on up over here, but we're gonna start wrapping it up here pretty soon, it does seem. Hey, this is a free demo, as I mentioned, available to you guys, so I definitely encourage you to, uh... Check it out for yourselves. Get some eyes on these developers. Oh, this is that one the other side. I definitely encourage you guys to check it out for yourselves and, uh, you know, put some in, or at least put some traffic on this developer Steam page. So far, you know, I gotta tell you, this is, uh, not bad. Wish I was not being blinded, for one. <laughs> I guess this is where they're coming from, huh? Just attack the horde. Oh my god. No, sir, I don't like it. Oh! The knife! Luckily we got four of these now. Now I, now, now I understand why they gave you a lot of these, huh? Now it makes sense. Alright guys, I'll have this game, as I've mentioned, linked on the uh, video description you guys to check out. So I mentioned, go ahead and uh, check this out for yourselves. Not a bad one. Catch you guys next time.